What is up, Dave Tackler Nation? Welcome to another installment of the Dave Man Show. And for the first time in three months, I'm home on a Wednesday night. Joining me down the hallway, Frank Ward. Hi. It's not really down the hallway. It's like kitty corner. I could shoot him with a Nerf gun from where I'm at. He's done before. I could throw the screwdriver at him. It's That's hurtful. And joining us from the bird's nest all the way out and wherever the fuck he's at, Gibby! What? 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 I think he's already done that one. He has. I don't know. I just do it ever. That's why it's amazing you duplicated. Yeah. I know. Are you running out of material to recast you? Yep. Yep. All right, I'm out, guys. (laughs) I'm out, guys. And joining us from Clarksboro, Barrow, Burrow, I got really too much Red Bull in my stomach. Tits McGee, they're Tanner. You sure it's not the Red Bull and that weird pill you took the other night? Uh, I've, I had to take three today. I'm up to three. Three? Now, so. Well, it's it's take take sure. two capsules with meal number one, and then one capsule with meal number two. Meal number two was only a buffalo chicken wrap and some pistachio. How has your heart not stopped? Because it's a cow. <laughs> Got it. I'm just curious because one pill was making you a maniac. Now that you're up to three, I'm scared. Did you consult your doctor before? Well, I consulted my talent agent who said you needed to be peppier on the show, and here I am, bitches, back in the best <laughs> Red Bull hydroxy cut hard. Uh, Wait, yeah, hardcore elite, okay. super thermogenic, lose weight, extreme energy, extreme. Discuss! Discuss! As he chugs a Red Bull to top it off. <laughs> Damn, Again, right. how does your heart not stop? Aspirin and sugar-free Red Bull. Exactly. There's no sugar, so it's fine. It vitalizes the body and mind and allows your mouth to run a mile a minute. And you can fly. I can fly. I'm going to try that. Get the camera, Frank! We're going to be famous! You know what's funny? When you asked me if I was wait. Tanner... I was kind of worried how you knew I went to the beach, but then I forgot I was on Snapchat. You know, Duber screenshotted one of my Snapchats. Was it the one with the boobs all out? Because I thought about it. <laughs> yes, it was. And you had, like, classy. your face next to somebody, and you're like, oh, we're having fun on the beach. And then it was like, tits. Bam. I added you on Snapchat because I missed this photo. <laughs> did you, you did not just add me. Is it, is it your story? Can I, can I still see it? Yes, it's my story. Yeah. Did you uh, get to get uh, enough? You'll see it. I hate you, Frank. It's, it's the reason she's on the show. I mean, you guys can't see out there in Radio Land, but the reason... Add her on Snapchat. Show. Yeah, find her on Snapchat at titsmcgee14. <laughs> Thank God you didn't say my real Snapchat. Smack my titties, 32. <laughs> yeah, smack my titties on the sand in Wildwood. What? Ocean what? City. Ocean City, fouls. So mm-hmm. I just got in from Boston, where they all oh. talk like they're from cars and shoppies on the sweaters and... A little bit of retardedness up there. It is so annoying, their accent. <laughs> Have you... Yet, yet you were saying it right there so, so well. I know. It rubs off on you a little bit. Your uh, your A's turn into odds. It won't show me your story. Damn it. because you're on Snapchat with your car and your sweater. I added you. Sweater. And your shoppy. Oh, Just go steal Dace's phone and look at it. No. The buttons are sticky. Hey, you're well, I don't. It's a smartphone. The screen's sticky. Makes uh, hard. I wonder how that happened. Well, just leave that sitting in the bathroom. I had a pretzel. Yeah, sure. One of those cinnamon ones from Annie Ann's. It just happened to look like Trish's face. <laughs> her, her face looks like a pretzel? Is that what you're saying? Uh, if you're for her face, it's okay. Yeah, I'd bite her face if it's a pretzel. And that's what we're going down. Is that the one we're going down, Gibby? Yes, that is definitely the road we are going down right now. They may have licked their face in the past, too, anyway. Yeah, Ew. Ew. They wouldn't surprise me. It sounds like a str- I like a lot of people's faces. So you've never licked my face. Yeah. You've never licked my face. You, there's good You're... reason why I haven't licked your face. Why? <laughs> I'm, I'm so He's sexy. He's probably such a disease. I don't, yeah, I don't want bird flu. Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to tra- travel to China. <laughs> Bunch of fucking needles in the ass. Like, oh, I gotta lick that bird over there. Well, here, you need seven vaccines before you lick them. Yeah, this one goes in your nipple. Don't yeah. ask why. Wow, that would hurt. Man, my nipples are hairy. Why are you doing 
doing that? Zoe Berg's not here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We're trying to call her back. Okay. Ready? It's like, what's going on? What the hell was that? <laughs> was that a Hot Wheels? Yeah, that was it does. It sounds like one of those things where you would stick like the zip tie in and pull it real quick. So oh, yeah, it's like a Hot Wheels car. Yeah, a Beyblade, Beyblade. Yeah, Beyblade basically, or like the biker mice from Mars toy that I had when I was a kid. <laughs> Anybody remember that, or am I aging myself? Okay, what now? Aging yourself, my friend. Biker mice, biker mice from Mars. Mm, vaguely You're familiar. Yourself. Actually, no, that that's vaguer, vaguely familiar. Thank you. Thank you, Frank. You You're all still older than me. What kind of toys did they have? Well, not much. It, it was the zip tie one. It was this bike, and it was a mouse on it, and it was like a, you stick the, the zip tie, and you pull it real quick, and the thing, the wheels would light up, and it would fire off. I think it was a cartoon. I was here said all this, and I kind of stopped listening because I'm fighting with Snapchat. It, you know what? I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not doubting it, but, like, I have had three of these pills of Red Bull. I can keep talking without anybody else putting any input in, so it's all good. Notice. We noticed. We're, we're just letting you go, man. We're just all good. That is the type of show we are running tonight. And with that being said, it's time for sports. If you follow sports, it's Major League Baseball in the American League. The Orioles are leading the division with the Tampa Bay Rays, followed by the Yankees and Blue Jays, a half a game behind, and the Red Sox can suck their dick because they're not going to catch up. In the AAL Central, the Royals are leading their division with the Twins following five games behind, Detroit six games behind, the Indians at 10, and the White Sox 11 and a half behind. In the AL West, topsy-turvy world, the Astros are still on top, followed by the Angels with four games behind, the Rangers five games behind, the Mariners 9, and the Athletics 10.5. I'm pretty sure you still have to breathe at some point. In the National League, the Cardinals are leading their division, followed by the Pirates, who are eight games behind, and the Cubs are safely at third with 10.5 behind. The Reds are in fourth with 15.5 games behind, and the Brewers can suck it. They're 21.5 games behind. Fuck you, Ryan Braun. You're bringing down my fantasy team. In the NL West, the Dodgers are leading their division, followed by the Giants, who are a game and a half behind, then the Diamondbacks, who are six, the Padres, seven and a half, and the Rockies, nine and a half. In the NL East, where nothing makes sense because it's not 2008, the Washington Nationals are leading the division, followed by the Mets, three and a half games behind, the Braves, seven and a half, seven games behind, the Marlins, 11 and a half games behind, and the Phillies, dead last, 17 games behind, with a win percentage of 3 4 2. Yes, yeah, that sucks. That's the NLB standing. Suck it, bitches! So are we going to tell you the Phillies game now that you have the jetpack? We should. Uh, I'm down. Oh, no. I've, I have off from the 17th to the 25th. I am in Tampa uh, from the 17th to the 25th. You're the worst. I'm just kidding. I am. No, I'm not. I'm actually I'll be in Iowa most of that time. Yeah. Oh, well, you guys all suck. Why did you take vacation that week? Yeah, really? Because, did you come to Iowa? Because okay. that was Warped Tour. Oh. Um, you did a whole... We, are you going for the whole tour? Is this where no. you party? No, but I just really wanted to get out of my job before I stabbed one of my coworkers. I, don't I stabbed somebody today. Don't matter. I yeah, didn't stab totally. anyone. I just left. Just stab them and just I'm, left. I'm getting ready to stab somebody, so I needed a week off or I was going to kill someone. Ah, stabby, stabby. Customers or uh, employees? Employees. Mm, stabby, stabby, choppy, choppy, chimmy, chaga. So I had 40 hours vacation time, and I was like, this week looks good. Vacation. <laughs> I kind of did that, but I didn't do that. So, that's what I'm just saying. But we should just pick a, Philly, a date then and uh, is do the Philly Is there a poll going around somewhere? There is. That's There's a the... poll on our event to go to the thing. To the Where? Oh. Uh, you're not invited. You're not invited. <laughs> Sorry. Clearly. Cause I don't have JK, I, just, I forget to send invites to people. I mean, there's not a poll. That poll was for Beer Olympics. I'm in the Beer Olympics poll. Uh, not for Philly's game. Man, Frank fucking... Wait a minute, am I in that poll? Yeah. <laughs> Vote. <laughs> I don't think I'm in that poll. You don't go on Facebook and then you bitch when we decide things without your opinion. Uh, it's not like Jimmy's opinion matters much anyways. It doesn't at all. Fuck <laughs> you. In other sports news, golf star Phil Mickelson is reportedly linked to an illegal sports gambling case. Fucker. If you don't make enough money as it is, you got to gamble it all away. What? 
fucker. But oh, there's an event going on the fourth, guys. I didn't know that. Yeah, it's called. You asked me. Oh, you know what? All right, sidetracking. All sports. You know how you sent me a text about, hey, when are you doing a Fourth of July party? It was there for the past three months. Fourth is all the. Yeah. When else would you do a Fourth of July party? I guess you expect, expect it like the second, because he's a douche. You're gonna hold it on the eleventh. Yeah, that's no, fucking tomorrow. Why? Do you, do you work Friday? Uh, do I? I don't. No, I'm off. I do. Because Michael, we... she hates me. Can we shoot some fireworks off on Friday? Fucking you. Bullshit. That's 4th of July. Then we'd be too close to Canada Day, and I don't want to celebrate that. I just get out of that country. I just liberated myself from Canada. Freedom! Oh, here's the poll. Let's freedom, see here. Freedom. I'm going to go with... Freedom. To go. Freedom. Can I get added to the poll? No one voted. So I voted. Go with that one. Not until you show me your tits. Oh. It's true. Not my fault. Snapchat doesn't like you. Hey, can I picture your boobs? I can watch it again. Can you? Yeah, you just go down to her. You scroll down to her feet thing. Think... Freedom. Show me them feet. Freedom. Them feet, girl. Show me them feet. Freedom. Hi, Dave. If you're listening. Hi, Dave. Who's Dave? Richardson. Really? Show... I yelled, "Show me them feet." Oh. Hi, Mike. Hey, Dave. Hi, George. <laughs> I'm a dead dumb mom from drinking. <laughs> Uh, sports is done. I'm at, I don't have, I don't see anything. Nothing's going on. NHL is no. in the off season. NL, uh, NFL is in the off season. Yep. And those uh, NBA. Wasn't there a golf thing going on? I just said it. Oh, okay. <laughs> he gambled stuff. Woo! Ever listen to me? Am I supposed to? Because I don't. I'm sorry. You should. Because you're always inquisitive. And you're like blah blah blah. You never tell me anything. Cause you don't fucking listen. Uh, blah blah blah. Maybe if you invite me to these chat things, all right? Exactly, he'll give you some. I try to leave those blah, blah. chat things. You fucking gorilla. We put you back in. I put you back in one earlier because yeah. that was funny. Sons of bitches! I try to leave these things because I don't want to hear the ding. You started it. I That's do start right. them, but okay. That chat. I thought there was business. A- I thought there was another reason. And then not pleasure. Up. Never pleasure. Just business. <laughs> there was definitely pleasure involved in that one. Never pleasure. Just business. That was clearly pleasure and business. And business on the pleasure. Fucking Ralph leaving his toys here. <laughs> Disgusting. Yeah, we could make it into an episode, all right? Yeah, well, Ralph leaves his shit here when he comes over and drinks on Saturday nights, and I don't want to find that type of stuff, Ralph. I don't think that was Dan Ralph. Oh, it's clearly Dan Ralph. He's been oh. lonely for like a year and a half. Exactly. Exactly. So it's clearly Dan Ralph. Fucking Dan Ralph. <laughs> fucking Dan Ramp. Mm, fucking Ramp. Oh, fucking Ramp. Get some Ramp. Ramp that damn Ramp. Ramp, 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 Ramp. Where the fuck's your sound bite? Oh, there it is. Time for weird news. We get it. quickly. Holy boy, it did. Crack a beer. Well, I, get in, I drink out of a glass, okay, my friend? Oh, I'm sorry. Are you the For one that gives you plant mm Mm-hmm. I just want to always drink beer, but what I do is... Filippo <sighs> <sighs> Herbert hey, um, thousands of dollars on thousands. transforming himself That's... into the man of Steel. Like Superman or literally made of steel? Superman. Exactly. You say man of steel, I'm thinking, oh my god, this guy's gonna look like Metal Mario. Why is it out on the sink? I don't know, Ash. I don't know. What's going on? I showed her the picture. <laughs> oh. Alright, anyway. Send us then, a picture. I need to look at Metal Mario. <laughs> yep. Lots of us dreamed of being a superhero. One man has gone a few steps further and transforms himself into the Man of Steel. Her oh, makeup? Chavez has gone, quick. undergone <laughs> 23 surgeries and a cost of more than 4,400 euros to give himself that famous look. Clutch chin? Clutch <laughs> chin, yeah. Really look, that's all he really changed. And blue eyes. That could be contacts. Wow, he put a lot of money for no reason. <laughs> um, but although he, uh, here. 
<laughs> Although he's now as close as he can be to Clark Kent, he's still not happy he's, and has been keen on getting more surgeries. Did he realize he's Latino and Superman's Caucasian? Yes, <laughs> doctors. <laughs> it's true. If he wants to be like the man, he's got to get white. Yeah. Uh, the 37 Michael Jackson, so I don't think that'll work. He's got like a fucking rebel name. Like he runs like a guerrilla militia in the fucking jungles to overthrow <laughs> Castro. And that's why he wants to look like <laughs> Superman. Follow me as a symbol. I, no, they, have a fuck with that drug they have a picture of him running in the Superman oh. costume. Really? Yeah, if you scan down some, there's if, a lot of pictures. Oh. If he's really Superman, he'd just fly. Look at all those poor kids around him. Mama, I'm not. Man, hey guys, I just wasted like a million dollars on this Superman get up and you're all poor and can't eat tonight. Oh, but oh, oh Superman. It says right here he's had skin whitening. Oh, so he was darker. Yeah. Well, I didn't say anything racist. He already did it to himself. Oh what? He did no. uh, Not a Red Bull. He's had a nose job, lipos liposuction, oh, skin right. whitening, see there you go. Fillers, jaw work. Why didn't I get the link? It's in the Skype chat. 18 years. I don't have it. Chavez, who fell in love with the star at the age of five. Yes, you're in the chat. You're with us right now. How much liposuction did he get done? Okay, I found it. Uh, To be honest, I don't know. It doesn't really look like he's... He didn't look fat before. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe he had a big ass. You don't know. He is Latino. (laughs) Jesus Christ. And I hid his teeth. Because he's got girl features. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he's got woman lips. He looks like Victor. I, <laughs> hello. Oh, my God. Welcome to 10 minutes ago. Yeah, if you rewind the show 10 minutes ago, Frank made that joke. <laughs> sorry for those of you from 10 minutes in the past. I'm oh, sorry. sorry. Sorry, Victor, if you're listening. <laughs> but you you're apologizing? Me. No. <laughs> you don't apologize for shit. <laughs> I'm just well. We actually already made fun of Dan. Uh, we just made fun of Victor. So I mean, we're we're pretty much checking off our usual bucket list. Exactly. It's a shame that all these inside jokes go to waste. It's okay. We're gonna make them characters in a TV show. <laughs> then you'll know what we're talking about, motherfuckers. Damn right. Damn right. All right. All right ready, let's ready, get ready, off the story one? number one. Story number two. Hey, man. Oh, God. This is so weird. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Who yep. played the role of Florida State's Somali mascot. 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 <laughs> For four years, was killed last week following an argument over gumbo. And he was hit by a cop. <laughs> gumbo. Was this down in Louisiana? Florida. Yeah, Nolan. Close enough. Uh, <laughs> Caleb Joshua. It's Caleb. It's Caleb. It's Caleb. Caleb. Who cares? Caleb is like it's the yeah. cross of Superman and Caleb. Uh, L L. Caleb died from his injuries last week. I can't. He you was me? stabbed during an argument with a coworker at a local restaurant over the amount of spices, which should be added to a batch of the very famous. Gumbo. Mm-hmm. You don't fuck with my gumbo. Mm-hmm. Haley reportedly got into an argument with the 26-year-old Orlando Thomas at Orlando Buddy Blue? Seafood Market, where the two men worked on Tuesday. As things in the kitchen heated up, Thomas grabbed a wooden board while Haley picked up a wooden knife. I'm going I'm to st- smack you with this switch. I'll take it over here, boss. Wait, you use a wooden knife? <laughs> yes, a wooden knife. A wood, what the fuck's a wooden he knife? He died from a splinter. Thomas then retrieved a knife for himself uh, and sensei. cut Haley three times across the torso. He tattled him right in the torso. Fucking Time torso. for your tanning. You looking for... That's a paddling. <laughs> Said my gumbo's not buzzing up? That's a paddling, too. What? 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 That's a paddling as well. We will be getting a paddling there every week. I mean, oh my... Until my gumbo right there, dang, 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 dang. need a pen. We are not we'll that racist. That's a pen. Are you kidding me? That's a, it's no. a Simpsons joke. Ding. You ever seen the episode with the old guy and that's a paddle? 
That's paddling. Ain't got doing glass, that's a paddling. Going down the river in a canoe, you're paddling. Just made that up. I'm hilarious. Continue! <laughs> Who's <laughs> a big pot? I got the gumbo. You good over there? I'm going to I'm going to stab no. you with my wooden knife. Okay, cat. <laughs> oh, it doesn't make it's wooden, so it just kind of goes. Okay. Hey, you probably should fill in the dead air because I will. <laughs> the state's budget has gone into effect Wednesday, along with 130 other new laws written by legislature this year. Hold it's on. a regular and special session and signed by Governor Rick Scott. Hey, Rick Scott. Oh, my God, we're being attacked! <laughs> dog. It's fucking Godzilla! Godzilla. <laughs> Dooley just signed off. Can we invite him into the call? Let them fight. Dooley? Dooley? People with 64-ounce beer containers known as growlers can now, in the state of Florida, get them filled at breweries. So are you, when are you moving to Florida? That's what I want to know. When do you guys want to move down? I'm not moving down. What do you mean? Well, we, can get 64s. we can get 64s. Did you want to live in Miami? For like- I did because of the Latina women and back when I was actually running. Now that I'm oh. not, I'd rather stay in the winter. I'm built for winter. Got a lot of warmth. Ford He's Tough. Very and large. Ford Tough. And all-wheel drive, baby. You're damn right. Well, kind of like half wheel drive. One of my speeds are fucked up right now. Still? Still. Well, I tried to run. Oh. And like, cause I was like, "Hey, I'm walking pretty normal this week," and then I ran and fell on my face. So it's it's not a hundred percent yet. I would say it's probably back at twenty five. Hey. <laughs> I have a. Oh, I'm out. I'm out. Yeah, it was like. Dun, 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 dun. That was the end. Interesting, interesting, interesting. I'm going to go into one of Dace's pastimes. All right. <sighs> All pastimes. Okay. Fine. All right. Okay. Ready? Are you ready? Are you ready for this? Collecting marbles? Pop picking. Midgets? We're, gonna go, midgets? we're going into Florida again. What the fuck, man? So don't the oldest. You don't have to talk about the oldest state all the time. Don't call him Mr. Hogan. What you gonna do, brother? Mr. Hulkster is off limits as well, unfortunately, my friend. What you gonna do? The former professional wrestler Hulk Hogan goes to trial. He hasn't retired. What? He hasn't retired. He's the current professional wrestler. Whatever. What you Uh, gonna do? Goes to trial in Florida next week against Gawker. Brother. The New York based news website he um The one that leaked his sex tape, right? Um you sure. Yeah. Bubba the oh. Love Sponge's wife. How long ago did that happen? <laughs> Back when the whole uh boobs weren't tagging. Oh, okay. Brother. Brother, um, brother, brother, brother. So brother. the judge in that case Look up Pokemon? <laughs> brother. Told the has told him. <laughs> They have to refer to him by his real name. Terry Bola. Terry Babola or something? Terry Bola? Terry Jean Baboli. Or Babola? Babola. Baba Babola. I didn't know his middle name, but I knew it was Terry Babola. Ebola? Ebola? Yeah. He's like a disease on the business. Um, so attorneys who are representing him in an effort to win $100 million in damages from Gawker for publishing an excerpt of his sex tape in 2012. They show him a penis, brother. Brother. That was only three years ago. Brother. Brother. In Hulkster time, it's five years ago, brother. Brother. Okay. My penis, brother. 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 It's got the same handlebar mustache, brother. Brother. <laughs> what you gonna do when the seven-inch python tries to penetrate you, brother? Uh, all right, so, basically, <laughs> so they're not allowed to call him Hulk Hogan, right? Because but WWE the judge, the name. <laughs> but the judge is allowing him to keep his trademark mustache and his white shoulder length his hair, face. as well as wear his Hulk Hogan costume to court. What? Why do you got to wear it to court? <laughs> it's the only way he knows to go out in public. Is he gonna come in with music? <laughs> when it comes <laughs> crashing now, <laughs> bus kicked uh, up in the courtroom. Courtroom doors. Just boom. Oh God, he's gonna like drop to the prosecutors. The it's judge. Like air guitar as he goes down. 
the no. judge, the judge also said that he can wear one plain bandana. Ah, uh, he well that I can understand. He does not like being seen bald. But he has no hair. He's got like this fake that goes into being bald. Does, do you even listen to anything we say, Trish? Yes, yeah, sometimes. This goes. He doesn't want to be seen bald, and then you said that's because he has no hair. I, I, it was like happening you know at the same me. time. It was happening at the same time. Shut up, Frank. Five minutes apart. He's You're got hair around his balls. And his ears. <laughs> brother. 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 That's all I got. All right, God. Oh, this garden snake coming after you. We need you, to give up. Leg dropping on the jury. You said garden snake? I may have. <laughs> I switched the uh, the uh, poor, little, poor little guy. Yeah, you got that. Wait, are you out of weird news? No. Two I'm just done with oh. that story. Brother. Thrillist website has came out. Of the closet? Yeah, it came out of the closet. Oh, no, no. Saying that I want the Florida. <laughs> Wait, why are we back in Florida again? We haven't left Florida. Did you go to like Florida dot com and it has because all these nothing stories. normal happens nope. in Florida? Yeah, nothing normal, and it's a, it's a very slow news week. I'm just saying. Clearly, you're just... anyway. Newscaster this... Gibby here says it's a slow news week. <laughs> this website ranks Florida the worst. In everything, I could tell why <laughs> they're on our show all the time. We don't do like good things on this show. <laughs> so they didn't actually clearly we have Gibby. Right. Yeah. So even though they <laughs> earlier in the year named South Tampa the sexiest neighborhood in the U.S. Oh, when among the broiest, I'm going to be in Tampa a couple weeks. Look? So can you and applauded me? Tampa steakhouses, bars, and nightclubs. Now, say Florida is the worst of all 50 states. Really? Because New Jersey gets a lot of flack. Yeah, we were probably pretty close. We're, we're 49. <laughs> Suck it, Florida. We moved up a spot. I mean, Florida doesn't have Camden, so that's a shocker. Straight out of Camden. I'll be here for you. So, Florida is the worst. Like down Delaware. Down. Miami's still down. better than Camden. Wait, Delaware's what? 49. Oh shit, we're 48. So where's Jersey? Go. 48 is Ohio. Get it. Oh, 47. Get it. Get it. Go. Wait, what is this list for? Uh, <laughs> where the hell is New Jersey at? If Damn. It, what is this list for? Did we make top 20? 21. Worst, worst states in America. Shut up. We're 20. We're the 21st, baby. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Better than general? Better than half. Where's no, Iowa? 25th. I'm sorry. You oh, said. we're higher than Iowa? <laughs> oh, oh, shit. Oh, uh, well, you moved here, so it's... Oh, shit. So we probably there dropped a drop the right there. there. Yeah, we, we probably dropped in the ranks once you moved here. No, I meant yeah. Iowa's dropped. Mm-hmm. Get it? That's why so, you guys went up. Get so, getting, getting going. So, number one state is what, guys? Oregon. California. What? Michigan. What? Is that one of the pot ones? Michigan's absolutely atrocious. Because they have Detroit. Michigan, they have Detroit. Maine, Kentucky, no, Wisconsin, hold on, Louisiana, Hawaii, Minnesota, Washington, Hawaii. California, California Colorado. Time out. Go. Time out. Detroit. It's Detroit. Mm-hmm. How is that number one place? Dude, I have a friend that lives in Michigan, and he hates his entire life. They have, have a suicide nothing. rate, don't they? No, they have, there's it's nothing Washington. to do there. That's there's Washington. nothing to do there. You sure Washington does? Because now they can get high. Uh, Maybe not anymore. Not after the pod legalization. All right. So did you guys know Michigan has more coastline than any other state other than Alaska? Like what? Even Florida? Oh, yeah, because there's a lot of there's a lot of lakes. But Florida. Florida is also a smaller state. It's a peninsula. Did you know New Jersey? It has such an. In, this was uh, mess. It has a crazy amount of beers. I could see that. I would drink a lot if I was in the village. get Bells and Founders in the same afternoon? I don't know what the hell that means. I uh, it's cause they're, they're probably two breweries. Is this article written in Michigan? Did you know the UP is so remote and uniquely beautiful that it almost feels like a secret 51st state? 
The what? Oh. I don't even know what that is. Yeah. Apparently they love British meat pies. Well, that's okay. Are you sure this <laughs> list isn't like the best place to live is Florida and the worst place is Michigan? This is the, uh, the most That would mean I was higher on the list. Did you know most Frank. presidents are more happy to apologize for Kid Rock? Isn't it happier? I don't know. No, it's not how it's well, written. He, wrote, he read it, so whoever wrote this doesn't know English. No, Gibby just doesn't know how to speak if English. You, I still have to buy him some phonics. Yes, to at least three of these, then you already understand Michigan's charm. I don't. Is this this guy? Okay, send me the article. This person's obviously from Michigan. Like, these are, this is why we're awesome. We hate Kid Rock like you. Okay, so if that's a standard, everybody hates Kid Rock. So everybody's got a point. Oh, we got uh, North Coastline. New Jersey uh, and North Coast everywhere. So, fuck you. Who's this? Published by Kevin Alexander and Matt Lynch. I only have got Twitter. I'm going to go on Twitter and fuck these two. You're going to fuck them? Oh, yeah. I'm going to cyberbully them. Are you okay, going to do it as a basement or just as you? Probably, as probably a little different than fucking them. Well, no. I'm going to virtually write them. Oh. It's happening. It's going down. Hey, M. Lynch. Senior editor at Thrillist, fan of eating and sometimes cooking. I'm not going to follow you. I'm just going to belittle you. The Hawkeye State is like the kid you bunk with at camp who has decent snacks and never tries to steal your diary and read it loud at lunch. Even though he, he can hear you weeping while you write your missives under the covers. Missives? God, sign in. So basically, it's pleasant, but not quite, not entirely memorable. All right, so we just... Hold on, Frank, I'm reading Iowa, bitch. We just, we just did Frank Corner. So to be Corner. fair... In we kind of did. We did do Frank with the Eskimo pie, the loose meat sandwiches, I would have... What? what? I feel what? like it, it's just like, oh, it's really nice. It has a great personality, but it's just ugly. You don't really need to be there. I so it's on describing Twitter. Frank. Tell these people yeah, exactly. how to fuck Iowa. So he, he wasn't describing Iowa. He was he describing It had a great you. personality. When yeah, was this true. list published? When, okay. Come on. Come on, Firefox. Uh, stop being a dick. June... <laughs> 2015. Okay, so 30th. Yeah, June 30th. Why aren't you using Chrome? Use Chrome, you loser. Get with the times. I've yeah, been no using shit. Firefox since I've been on internet. <sighs> okay, Ready? old man. Tweet to Matthew Lynch. Matthew Lynch, your list of the definitive and final ranking of all 50 states is Ballsack. <laughs> Ballsack. Do you live in Michigan? Do it, do it. You should probably shoot yourself. <laughs> <laughs> if if you need a gun and bullets, just let me know. Jersey rules. Suck an egg. Give me. Give me Great answer. Great okay, answer. I am for 24 characters. I need to try to shorten this down, and I'm going to look retarded when I do. All right. Okay, going to oh. change the word you to you. <laughs> Look at him. You he looks like he's from Michigan. Right? To you, you should probably... Okay, you should just shoot yourself. Not probably. Probably <laughs> too many others. Shoot yourself. Jersey rule. Hashtag Jersey rule. That'll tell you when they come to the pieces. Hashtag... Ooh, Busty Blacks follow me on Twitter. Oh, uh, nice. What? No, oh, it's you or Mike or the Dace Man Show. What do you mean mine? It's mine. It just has your name. Which makes it mine. But you've done nothing for it, except for supply the name. Which is the whole thing. I think it's it literally my Twitter handle with the word show at the end. Mm, is it? It is. Is it? it? It is. I don't know why we're debating this. Are you sure about <laughs> that, Dace? Are you is sure? Uh, I think we got you. Nah, I got you. Okay, so I can't put... Suck an egg, so I'm just going to put Gibby. Suck a Gibby? No, it just says Jersey Rules Gibby. Even though it's, it's coming from Chris Dace. All right, took care of that harassing. Gibby, next story. <laughs> what about you. the other guy? He's out of it because I'm too lazy. <laughs> but if you're listening, fuck you too, Kevin Alexander. The stupid He's name. From Cal- He's from Texas. A- in Texas? Texas, raised in Massachusetts, and now lives in California. And likes Michigan? Go fuck a, He's vanished from several of those things. A slippery customer was asked to leave a branch of Wheat Rose after taking a snake shopping with him. Oh. 
astonished, astonished as a man browsed the supermarket aisles with his pet royal python hanging from his neck. Is this Jake the Snake Roberts? Is this two wrestling stories in one shot? This is fantastic. He was eventually asked to leave the shop in Beckenham, southeast London, on Saturday evening. Witness Rachel Davis uh, told news shopper it was around his neck. He went inside and he was holding the head of the snake. He didn't seem the least bit concerned, but one lady with her baby was really concerned. Not Royal Python... Royal pythons are not venomous, but can grow to more than six feet in length. They are considered doctile and... Doctile! Doctile! Learn English, Gibby. are a Stop. proper choice for people wanting snakes as a pet. Gibby, how did you graduate high school? I got a master's degree, so don't worry about it. <laughs> God! You do not. She does. What do you mean I don't? I have that. You were a master. Okay, now. You know the word docile? Yeah. It doesn't matter. Speaking is not needed. Reading is not needed. It is for a podcast because that's all you're bringing to the table is speaking. Uh, I'm, I'm in physical pain right now. It's got us. Oh, uh, we're, we're pretty butthurt about it. It sucks for you, my friend. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> that's awful. That's awful. All right. <sighs> Alarmed by multiple pleas for help from relatives of a seven-year-old Northern Kentucky girl who reported that the child was being abused and neglected at home. Is she an aide? Social worker Carrie Cooper checked on her at school. She found the girl hungry and unkept with hair like a rat's nest. Cooper would later report in a letter to... Teresa James, State Commissioner of Social Services. The girl told her she had not seen a therapist required to a court agreement, often came home to an empty house, didn't get regular meals, and frisbee went hungry. In her to be effort, you, nerd. Cooper. In her, efforts, in her efforts, Cooper now faces disciplinary action and possibly terminating. That is one big pile of shit. Employment. In Northern Kentucky, the State Cabinet for Health and Family Services. Her offense? Unknown to Cooper, the other worker had closed Cabinet's long-running case on the girl's family, finding no further action was necessary. Cooper said she was informed... She was informed that she violated Cabinet policy by visiting the child. Cooper had been yanked had been yanked off her regular duties to the special investigator social special investigator state social worker in Boone County. Wait, wait, what was the name of County? Boone B O O N E. I thought it was Steve. My bad. Go on. Okay. <laughs> I said my dad move on. Alright, Boob County, how's that sound? Oh no. Investigating I... the most serious and complex cases. For the past six weeks, she had been assigned to desk duty typing cases notes while her supervisor considered what actions to take. This was my job, at least I thought it was, said Cooper, who had worked with the girl's family for nearly a year before the case was transferred to another worker. Here they've lost track of 92 cases, and I'm in trouble because I went to see one kid. hoo ha See that guy? Right. Aren't they in Kentucky? That would explain a lot. Chicken? No, it's because just because just they married their sister doesn't mean anything. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm a freaking nature! Dollars. And that's all I got today for you guys. Really? That's Gibby's that's Gibby's corner. What do you mean really? Fucking bullshit! He went on for like, that... like a day and a half. It's true. Well, he did cover up because we didn't have really too many support. All right. Well, I can click on this thing. This thing sounds pretty funny. <laughs> what are we Give me a second. It's Godzilla! Ah! Uh, what's up with Walmart? A Louisiana was frustrated by his local Walmart after refused to feature an image of the Confederate flag on a cake he ordered. He was trying to fly, fly what? He ordered a, a Confederate oh, flag cake. Wait, win! White Swan! Race Wars over, everybody! White Swan again! 
That's all I got. Sweet. Now it's time to head to the corner. Oh, my God. Frank, here is your shot. To be in the corner. Following interpretation is brought to you by taste and good form. Tell me something, my friend. Ever dance with the devil in the pale moonlight? Extra, extra, we all are fine. Wait a minute, wait a minute. You ain't heard nothing yet. <laughs> Nobody can stay in the corner. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Frank's Corner. <laughs> this is your host, Frank. Yay! Thanks, guys. Wasn't that just swell? What? Uh, I figure since we're all pretty much single here, including Gibby, he just won't admit it yet. Newly single. What up? Might as well. Should be single. Hey, what happened to the call-in number? The call in number got removed. Remember? Oh, it moved over to the other side. Seven six zero five one two seven two four seven. If you're looking for a date, if you're a fatty, I'll put you to Frank. If not, hey, how's it going? Oh, why? Yeah, why do you encourage callings during my segment? Your segment. Like I don't have enough interruptions as it is. <laughs> we can't <laughs> disrupt. We can't disrupt Gibby and his bullshit of what he does. Yo, 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 yo. I don't yo, want to scare yo, people. Yo, away. yo, <laughs> yo. Yo. What? I'm nice. Okay? <laughs> You're not. Oh, Get over it. That's terrible. Oh, I'm sorry. God. Anyway, I bring to you a whole bunch of pickup lines. Hoo-ha! Do they work for you? There's a lot. Hold on, what's Wait, this? you just flat out admitted in Walmart the other day you have no game. That's why I'm bringing a pickup line, bitch. <laughs> I have game. Boy. Well, no, Dave, we already decided that since they legalized gay marriage, you and Frank finally have a chance to get married. But I don't do gay marriage. Oh, you have a chance to get married, Dave. That's cool. Uh, we're go- hey, we're going for common cool. law. We're he going for common more law. more time that's in right. your place. We're yeah, I know. That's common. the thing. I'm yeah. never even home either. Yeah. So he's sniffing your panties, man. Oh. 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 <laughs> oh, man. Oh, I need that panties. Why, why, why do they smell like cheesesteak? Don't ask me. <laughs> Okay, why do they smell like cheesesteaks? I, I, underwear smells like laundry detergent, like oh, every like, other okay. underwear. Do you, do you wash your laundry Are you sure cheese about that? Yes, I wash my underwear in cheesesteaks. So Frank was right. So Frank is sniffing your panties. I guess so. It's official. Thank you guys for joining us tonight. That has been the Dave's Man Show. Peace out, bitches. And Frank Never didn't done. get in sex. Yeah, I was actually good. I was trying really hard not to do it this episode, but we are no, close to the hour mark. It's so a like, corner. It's a very secluded place. Like, well, we're in the where Frank cries. We're in the at like the time frame where I usually hit that button. It's not my fault. It, yeah. It, so you, you just got to speed up all the other processes, and you do get through your corner and a lot easier. Yeah, for the people, for the problem. Nope. Nope. No. 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 Oh, okay. Not bad. Not, not even. The, the hydroxy cut. We're going through right now. Why? The hydroxy cut screwing up his sense of time too, Frank. Right no, he, like, lolled out for a little bit. He was over there playing with buttons, counting his toes or something. Sure, I was eating his toe jam. I can't lift my feet up. See? I have a bad ankle. Why would you make fun of a cripple like that? Yeah, why would you make fun of a cripple? Yeah, bitch. Oh. Is what, Nick here? What What just happened? Is Nick here? I feel... I'm, oh, God. Hold on. I gotta go turn on my bedroom light because I'm scared. No, there's a ghost in, in the studio. I didn't when click I just, that. No, Dave, when I used to host the show, for some reason, whenever I signed in, it would play the Tits and Zoidberg theme first. It's because that's what I set it up to be. You Why were, would you do that? You were hosting. Yeah, every single time you wanted to be the Tits and Zoidberg theme? It wasn't me hosting. All right, well, then I'll do it my theme from now on. All right. right. Too late, because he's back. I'm back, bitches. He's, he's back. back. Okay. So have a good night. No, he's can, black. Can I can I finally give some pickup lines? I didn't. Dave, where are you going to be next Wednesday? I'll be here in Jersey. Have a good night, everybody. <laughs> nope, not time. Oh man, guys. No, I'm going to do it that time. I, hey, I that, that was a great show, man. I, this I, right think, now. I think it was uh, pretty hey, good. If, if we pretend that the show I did, we usually have better conversations. 
Sam Petro. Very good. That point. was a good show, my friend. Good show. <laughs> Great show. Hey Frank, do you ever have a list? No, I'm I, I'm good. Pick up line number one. I don't have a thing. He's a dick. <laughs> You really shouldn't wear makeup. You're messing with perfection. Wink. Mm, that's just cheesy. I added the wink in. <laughs> My friends bet I can't talk to the prettiest girl. Want to use their money to buy drinks? Wink. I don't have a library card, but do you mind if I trick you hey, out? Hey, hey, hey! I like your skeleton card. structure, baby. You're an ectomorph, not no doubt. Your, wait, what is happening? Your face is real symmetrical, what, no, what are you doing? and what your are nostrils you doing right now? are so nice. What, what are you girl? I that I was cross-eyed girl, what, what so I could right now? see you twice. Girl. So you smell like Fritos. You must be a Pokemon, because I want to take a peek at you. Can I put you <laughs> in your face with my lips? You remind me of my dead ex-girlfriend. Oh? Well, <laughs> girl, you smell like Fritos. That's why I'm giving you this hungry stare. The things that I would do if I got a few roofies in you. You're so hot, you're going to melt the elastic in my underwear. The fact that I'm missing my teeth just means that there's more room for your tongue. I'll bet you're magically delicious, like a bowl of Lucky Charms. Oh, yeah. My love for you is like diarrhea. I just can't hold it in. Oh, come on, that's a lyric further down in the song. (laughs) What song are you singing? I Want to Be Your Lover by Weird Al. Yeah, you you didn't pick up on that? (laughs) Get the hell out of here. You'd look like Venus de Milo if I just cut off your arm. I've been slightly de- depressed ever since my vasectomy. Do you believe in love at first sight, or should I walk by again? I'm bigger and better than the Titanic. Only 200, mem- only 200 women went down on that vessel. Frank okay. already said the diarrhea line. Next. <laughs> if I can't buy you a drink, at least let me fix your laptop. Stop, drop, and roll now. Because, baby, you're on fire. If I jumped on your back, would you beat me off? I'll bet your outfit makes a lot of noise in the dryer. I would absolutely love to swap bodily fluids with you. This one's for Trish. You're absolutely perfect. Don't speak now. You might spoil it. (laughs) Damn right. (laughs) And this is why they're all single. I want to live in your sock. I can be with you every step of the way. Your eyes are even bluer than the water in my toilet. I want to floss with your pubic hair. Say, no. Has anyone ever told you you've got Yugoslavian hands? No, of course not. That would be stupid. Just forget I ever brought it up. Hey, baby, you got any diseases? Want some? I want to be your Krakatoa. Let my lava flow all over you. Oh, yeah. As long as I have a face, you'll have a place to sit. <laughs> I want to be your anaconda and your heat-seeking missile, too. Do you mind if I hang out here until it's safe back where I farted? <laughs> I, I want to be your beef burrito. Am I making this perfectly clear? Are you menstruating? If so, I know how to insert tampons. Oh, my God. I want to be your love torpedo. Are you picking up the subtlety you innuendo here? Did your father have sex with a carrot? Because you have nice eyes. What? Carrots are supposed to make your eyesight better. Oh. Not orange? No. I hope I'm not being forward, but do you mind if I chew on your butt? (laughs) Yeah, do you mind if I chew on your butt? Your eyes are as blue as my toilet water at home. You can tell me truthfully, am I steaming hunk of love now or what? Yes. You smell. We should take a shower together. There just aren't oh, enough O's in smooth to describe how smooth I am. <laughs> you owe me a drink. You're so ugly, I dropped mine when I saw you. <laughs> oh, geez, that's, that's, a pick-up a, line? that's a great pickup line right there. Yeah, degrade them first, Days. Degrade them first. That's Put them down, that's then you pick them back up. Maybe you've seen my picture. It's in the dictionary under kablam. <laughs> you don't sweat much for a fat chick. Why is yeah. that? <laughs> okay. My lips are registered weapons. Can I invade your personal space? That's just a little creepy. What's a slut like you doing in a classy joint like this? Oh my god. You must have fallen from heaven. That would explain how you messed up your face. 
Where are you guys reading these from, anyway? I'm still going with the song. Oh, you are? I, yeah, I, as long as that song. It's pretty long. <laughs> do you want to have... Do, do you want to have good sex? No. Well, come to my place. <laughs> well, how do you get through security? Because, baby, you're the Bob. Let's play Barbie. I'll be Ken, and you can be the box I come in. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to take you home right now so you can meet my mom. You, you know why they call me the Cat Whisperer? Because I know exactly what the pussy needs. Girl, you must be Jamaican. Because you're making me crazy. Repeat. You're so hot. You're so hot, I could roast my meat on you, baby. Oh, the song ended, so I'm done talking to you. <laughs> I thought we had a good thing going here. You Thanks. look familiar. Have we had sex before? I used that one! <laughs> Sorry. Did, Did it work? work? Yeah, that, that's all I care about. Did uh, it actually work? No. They kind of walk away mad. Especially if you have slept with them before. Did uh, you? Yeah. That one, no. But you did look at someone. <laughs> somebody that I used to know. You remind me of my cousin. I want to fuck you so bad, but I know I can't. What? <laughs> Virginia. <laughs> All right, Dinkleberg. What? <laughs> Mr. Dink, not Dinkleberg. I don't give a crap. Dinkleberg. There's a sound clip for that. I didn't have to say it. See, we don't need a soundboard. I just No, I think he deleted the Dinkleberg sound clip. No, he didn't. I think. I was looking for it. I couldn't find it. I will. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's still there. I will walk away. Dinkleberg. Okay, good. Deleted the London one. Um, and it, some of the less treasure ones. Hey, you're a girl. I'm a guy. Let's fuck. Hey, hey boing. <laughs> hey, tie your shoes. Hey, tie your shoes. I don't want you falling for anyone else. Oh. Your ass is so nice that it's a shame you have to sit on it. Oh. I've got a seat for your ass. Bull box dick. Your shirt has to go, but you can stay. Wink. Wink. You get naked. You make me wish I weren't gay. I wouldn't leave with that one. Yeah. I give it a shot. I wouldn't leave with it. You look so, uh, trash, man. Chris, how many of these lines would get you in the sack? Oh, she's already mm. moist. <laughs> <laughs> Girls hate that word. I know, that's why I said it. Moist. moist. I don't understand it. It's just a word. Moist. Doesn't bother me. You might be asked to leave soon. You're making the other women look bad. Wink. When you followed up with the wink, it really sends it home. I know. That's why I'm at, That's at, why I'm adding in the wink. And I'm also picturing Victor delivering every one of these. <laughs> That's hey, one night. Wow. Yeah. Well, Kerbin hey, was on in the chat room for a little while. Who? Kerbin. Kerbin wants me to go to. The, Kerbin wants to go to the beach. Monday. Uh, I work on Monday. He wants to go. In the week. I work on Wednesday. I might have. Well, she tried to plan it with me, and I was. You don't. You don't need to go. I don't have my phone. He, 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 he invited me. He's going to make you pay for the trip. I, 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 if I don't go when you go, I'm not paying for anything. Mm, you have to. True. He just wants to stare at your boobs. Everybody saw that Snapchat. Your tits were out there, girl. I did not see it. <laughs> you I didn't see out. it either, man. It was like softcore porn on your Snapchat. Yeah. I mean, Frank, if it's really that big of a deal, just go take Dace's phone. You dare touch my phone. He's all the way over there. Why don't you just send him a picture just to get it over with? No. Just do you mind just take the top off? Oh, shit. I've got like 10 text messages. Sorry. No. One from Trish. One from Kerbin. What has 36 teeth and holds Another back the Kerbin. Incredible Hulk? My nope. zipper. Wink. On Snapchat right now, so I can watch it again. Look at them. With my IQ and your body, we can make a race of super children. Frank, you missed it. He was on Snapchat. Yeah, he's over there. Like Lady. two doors away, a lot of walking. I can't get to him. Uh, I'll take care of you, Frank. What's a nice girl like you doing in a dirty you mind like mine? It, didn't you? <laughs> yeah, my buddy. My my man, my nigga. Oh. Whoa! Yeah. 
said it. I stopped. Yeah. Wait, we're allowed to say it anyway, right? Yeah, and the ACP said it's cool. And I'm st- I stopped after the G, kind of. After I realized what was happening. Ah, well, what's G? If you go one G in, you're already fucked. <laughs> you, wait, you can't say the first part? Like, well, if you're going to say nugget, you can't say nug. Yes. People okay. who annoy you. Naggers! <laughs> oh. And this may seem corny, no but you make me us. really horny. Urban yeah. listens. I bet I can kiss you on the lips without touching you. And then do it, and then, oh, seems like I lost the bet. <laughs> yeah, and now you've got her. <laughs> <laughs> on a scale of 1 to 10, you're a 9, and I'm the one you need. Ooh, Wait. to make it 10. I get it, Matt. Math always works. Unless they're dumb. Like, how long does it take to get 80 miles per hour if you're trying to drive 80 miles? Oh. So Trish is screwed. Did you get it? Did you get it? Mm-mm. I didn't Did get it. Did you send it. it to all of them? Just what? you and Frank. I got it! I need to see yourself again. I'm done with my corner. Move on. I got things like to Like, you are one set. Actually, the left one, or well, probably be your right. Your right one looks like it's already popping out. Did you steal that from an infant? Steal what? I'm going to send it to Gibby, too, because he needs to see this. Oh, oh man. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Actually, I don't know if I want to send it to Gibby after that noise. <laughs> it's a little late now. Now I'm scarred for life. Yeah, you just got, like, vocally raped. Sorry. <laughs> it happens though sometimes, you know? You're sighing like you had to clean yourself up after that. <laughs> He's just, he's, yeah, he's gone. So there's no political news tonight except for the fact that Chris Christie has entered into the presidential race officially. And he's going to lose. Uh, I took some kind of test that lets you go through and select answers and stuff. Apparently I'm a Jeb Bush guy. So Really? Yeah, second is Bernie Sanders. Yeah, it sounds more like you. <laughs> Uh, but Jeb Bush, Jeb Bush was like 74%, Bernie Sanders like 73 so it was very close. Oh, basically, I, had like, I had like 84% Bernie. So it's like, well, basically everything was anything liberal and democratic, like by like social uh, choices were Bernie related. Anything economics and business was Jeb. That makes sense. Yeah, because uh, I don't like giving money to poor people. Nope. <laughs> really? what? The, the one question is like, do you think people on welfare should have to work for it? And one answer was, no, it's a form of slavery. You're being paid. It's not slavery. Just say. No, I, I don't. Don't get me started on welfare issues. Oh, no, no. I completely agree. And that's why right. I get Republican. Let's 90%. get started, my guys. Time for the holiday or Hollywood stories? Holiday. 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 Rock. And celebrity news. That's the thing we're using today. Stephen Colbert did a local interview on public access TV in Monroe, Michigan, with rapper Eminem. Really? Yeah. So if you live in Michigan, check it out. If you don't, uh, you're probably you really evidently send me the best state city out Canada. there. What can did I you really that? send me my own Snapchat? I wanted you to see the boobs. I, I see them. They're my. They're, they're my own. They're huge. Like I'm aware. But like in person, they're not that big. Well, I don't wear bathing suits around you more. Oh, I think uh, we have to institute a new policy for you. Oh, uh, yeah? You can't come unless you're wearing bikini uh-huh. top and yoga I, pants. I think that should be the rule for uh, basement protocol. In, well, she is a hooker. All the views. All of the views. Yeah. Oh, my God. So many views. That, that's your outfit. We need to sexually exploit you. Yeah. No. I'm come sorry. On. But you got to do it for the views. Yeah, we you don't have a brain. Ellie, but she's way too pasty. And young. I feel she's legal though, right? But I yeah. feel like I'm violating her when I think of her that way. She's a crustacean. Why? We leave her as a crustacean. But, but not me? No, you talk like a fifty year old woman, so <laughs> what? Yeah, we're good. Kinda of like a sailor. So sometimes I don't I forget you're a woman until I see Snapchats like that. I can understand the sailor. I can understand the sailor part. Like that's gonna be your default picture now on my phone. I don't have to use somebody else's pair of tips. You oh, you should be, somebody should be proud. Yeah, I've been using some other girl okay. that had, like, cupcakes. You should be proud. Yeah. I actually have a picture of you now. 
Gibby's bubbles. I'm, 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 I'm extremely proud. Gibby's what am I? bubbles, and his name is Sir Gibbous the Bird. What am I? You're Frank. <laughs> <laughs> it's a picture of you. I don't. <laughs> you just happen to have the Facebook picture or whatever. You know how sometimes it sets that shit up automatically? Yeah. These other ones I had to put stuff in. But no, 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 you're Butters. You're Professor Chaos. Oh, yeah. Forgot about that. No, no, you're you're not Professor Chaos. You're Butters from Stick of Truth, where he's running around with a hammer. I'll take it. Did you do something with a hammer? I did something with an axe. Yeah, see, the current picture I have for uh, Patty McTitties over there is this girl with, like, happy birthday on her tits. So it's now going to be your actual tits. You have Hooray! I'm extremely happy. It'll be your profile picture on the website. I can't even say that. Oh, that's a good idea. Oh, my God. In other celebrity news, London has fallen. The trailer for the Olympus Has Fallen sequel will release today. It's out there. Go check it out. I'm not going to check it out. (laughs) Why would they? Why would they post that news story today that they would say is releasing today? Oh, you make because, okay. like Reddit said, it's there now. Go. So Reddit went crazy the other day and took Nick Cage's face <gasps> on all of the Game of Thrones characters. <laughs> all right, I, think I like that. Gibby will be busy later tonight. That damn right. I Are you kidding me? He has a picture of Trish and Nick Cage on every Game of Thrones character. Stop. You sent that to Gibby. I did. I told you I was. Oh. <laughs> what? Oh. Yeah, he you on Snapchat, didn't he? No, did he? I did. No. Oh. I don't know how, so I didn't bother. <laughs> <laughs> so I just gave him the good. The rest of it's usually the dumb dog. So this was like a gem in the fucking rubble. Diamond in the rough? Yeah, I didn't want to use that one. It's cliche. Oh. Cool. Mainly you be, be the Aladdin lover that you are. You named your dog Jafar? No, you. You're saying you. You wouldn't use the diamond in the rough reference when you love Aladdin. True. But it wasn't the time to quote Aladdin when I'm talking about your tits. Why not? Why would I corrupt my childhood? Because I was innocent back then. I was innocent. You were never innocent. I don't Uh, I was a virgin when I watched that movie. Now, it it hurts a little bit. Like syphilis. Uh, Freddie Mercury, (laughs) the radio station creates a mashup of late queen frontman laughing at Kanye West. You want to check that out? That's on the internet. Uh, and Volkswagen had a technician killed by a robot at a production plant in Germany. Terminator is happening. Speaking of Terminator, that opened up last night, and I have yet to see it. Who wants to go? Right now? Right now. All right. Is there a showing? I'd go. I'm not even kidding. The Delphi Drive-In has it this weekend. I don't want to sit outside. It's hot outside. I mean, if you pay, I'll go. If I had a convertible, I'd go. Oh, if you pay, she'll go. Is there going to be more yeah. pictures like that on Snapchat? I feel like this is a premium Snapchat account thing i got to get going. I mean, it's <laughs> summertime, so if I go to the beach again, sure. So everybody else gets it free, but me paying for your movie ticket gets me nothing extra? I don't see the post. It doesn't make sense. Then no. Doesn't make sense. Oh, if you're actually going to pay. Ah, shit. All right. I'm in. For what? <laughs> it's a good Snapchat. Yeah, how do, we, how do we subscribe to this? And what you do subscribe. is she sets up a GoFundMe. You submit the money to the GoFundMe, and then she just adds you to a private Snapchat account. Look at that. Trish, I'm making, making you money, money here. for you. Yeah, <laughs> really. How much are we charging here? I could think of like four people that would subscribe to it for at least a day. You, Frank, Dan, and Gibby. No, I wouldn't pay money for this. Uh, I would pay for a day. I've spent money on worse, like that African child. <laughs> <Man>. <laughs> That was a stupid choice. Yeah. I'm never donating to that box again. Dan Ralph would probably pay for like a month. For a year. Dan Ralph would still be. Yeah, I don't think Dan Ralph would end his subscription ever. It would repeat. Unless he actually gets a girlfriend, then he might. But then uh, he would clear it out in all existence. Like he would try to get money. Dan Ralph would never end his subscription. (laughs) So what you hear is you get a steady paycheck from Dan Ralph. It's, well, that doesn't help because he doesn't have a steady paycheck right now. Yeah, he does. The government, man. Jeez. No, no, he got denied. Oh, he did? Really? <laughs> I didn't know that. That's hilarious. Yeah. Oh, it was a rough great. weekend for him. Oh, man. Left Poor the yellow here. Fucking got denied by the government for unemployment. It's because he's white. Obviously. Can't win all the battles. He got his gay marriage thing going, so it's all good. They probably listened to this show when he was on it. <laughs> yeah. They're like, oh, fuck that guy. He ain't getting shit. 
I mean, either way, I don't know how Dan could pay for that if he can't even pay for himself. Also, a very good point. But he would probably find the ten bucks a month or whatever the fuck you would charge. No higher right. than ten bucks, people probably wouldn't pay. Or you'd have to push it out every day. You got to keep it just cheap enough that people are interested. Yeah, like a dollar. A dollar is actually a pretty safe bet. Uh, fifty cents. I'd maybe pay fifty cents. Yeah, after that, fifty cents with like a three ninety five handling fee. Yeah, <laughs> it's a trap. That's a damn trap. So let's go around the horn. Hear what everybody's got going on. Franklin Ward, let's start with you. Um, actually, what I, I have some very, very exciting news. Just hit, uh, hit the horn. Hit, hit it. Go to thedaysfanshow.com. Check it out. It's changed. It's oh moving God, in the right direction. That up on me. It's finally starting to move towards what we hoped and dreamed. It's like Twitter. We have a lot more to do to it. <laughs> I tell you, well, we got, I got to talk. Who's, who's doing this? Travis and you? Yeah. Well, you're really just Travis. He's he's still creating a framework, and then eventually I'll add content unless he it, makes it, it a lot. It's a it. white page with the Dates Man Show Twitter. And, and yeah, we can get a feed going where all of our Twitters are on here. But it already says no front page content has been created yet. Like it's in the fucking works, but it's beautiful. No, I'm just saying with the tweet, the Twitter, the Twitter part over here. I was yelling at Tim, oh. not you. We could put a feed in so it has the Dace Man Show, Frank Ward, Trish, and me. Maybe he doesn't have a Twitter, and it's probably for the best. <laughs> uh, he probably have a Twitter for a day before he got banned. Although I actually I, create one for school. You did? Usually I people delete theirs because of school. I don't know what it is, but yeah. <laughs> well, if you want to create another one called Sir Give I, Us the Bird. I got I got extra Can credit for liking a teacher on it, so I got it. Okay, I'm going to set you up an account right now. <laughs> All right, have fun. I just need your email. Fuck you. So <laughs> give us the bird at gmail. Well, we could use the daceman at gmail.com. Did no. you use that for the daceman show? Yep. I don't know what we used for. Whatever. Have you? Ch- okay, give me what do you got going on. I have... Um... You're in the gmail.com. There it is. You're one and only. Tits McGee, what's going on? I have a wedding and I'm ready to blow my brains out, so nothing. Why? Suicide. Suicide. Check out everything that's going on at fanboysnotice.com. The panel from Too Many Games will be up uh, soon, hopefully by the end of this week, as well as our coverage of walking through the convention, which is so much fun. I want to do that at more conventions. Thanking Monster Mania. We go for a day and we just record us being idiots. When are we go? When is that? I want to go. Who's going? July thirty first. Oh, I don't. Killing me. They don't do press, so we'd have to buy a pass for the day. Oh yeah, I, I don't think I can do that right now. Um, okay. so there's that. Let me know uh, how much, when, how. I think it's like uh, go to monstermania dot net. That's a free plug for them. <laughs> yeah. Um, and you could get the ticket prices there. When I used to go, which was a couple years ago, I think it was only like twenty bucks, thirty bucks at the most. Uh, that's cool, man. Uh, it's, uh, well, it depends on what day you're taking. Dead? It'd be like a Saturday. You said dot .net. Dot .net. I went to dot .com. That's a porn site. Is it? No. Oh, hold on. I'm getting distracted. Uh, no, check it's out. Not. It's not. It's not. Oldtimewrestling.net. Uh, they have a show July 18th at 7 p.m. Yours truly will probably not be on the show. He's nursing an ankle injury, and he's repackaging uh, his character. So there's big things coming for that for the fall season. But check it out. The main event is Adam the Great Chan- uh, Adam Chandler the Great. Let me fuck up their names. Versus the King of Class, Andy Bivens, uh, for the World Heavyweight Championship, as well as other matches to be announced as we get closer to the date. VIP um, tickets are 150 dollars. Yeah, I think VIP gets you in Thursday night to party with the guests, which we could do, and then try to interview them. We'll talk about it. We will be at Monster Mania uh, at one day at least that weekend. So if you see us running around looking like idiots, uh, this is MonsterMania.net. Yeah. If you see us running around looking like idiots, feel free to stop by and talk to us. Uh, Basement Protocol is back, and it is coming to hit harder than last year. And by that means we're going to film everything, get it up, because we started earlier in the summer. I'm here. And Frank's here. Frank is in the building. Uh, We actually have writing sessions going on tomorrow night and Friday night, with hopefully filming in the weekends to come. So keep your eyes posted to the Basement Protocol YouTube, as well as the Dace Man Show YouTube, where hopefully we'll get new content up as well, because yours truly will be back for at least a week 
and maybe Frank and I can start getting things together for like the duel, maybe. What? Uh, we can get some more Let's Play videos, Gibby. What? So okay. we'll, we'll figure it out. We're going to get content. Uh, yours truly woke up with a new sense of vigor and tried to get things done because he doesn't want to do his job anymore, and he wants I to get famous. Him. So for I the few. Famous. Nobody gets that Monster Mania. Malcolm huh? McDowell's there. That's the only one. He's the man. Hold on. But that's the only one. They're getting way too much plugage for a show that uh, they're giving us press passes. Just saying. Nev Campbell's going to be there. Nev Ca- yeah, Nev Campbell's going to be there. She's, she's like ancient. Fucking Brad Dur Daniel Harris. Actually, I met all these people already. Yeah, so no one good is going to be there. They'll still make announcements at the end of the month. Give them time. They'll have some big ones. Fucking X Pac and Ted DiBiase there. <laughs> I'm sorry, who? The Million Dollar Man. You can't. Mm. <laughs> Everybody, it's Ted DiBiase, the Million Dollar Man. If you want to have a priceless experience, then you'll stay tuned to Mega Powers Radio. And remember, everybody's got a price for the Million Dollar Man. <laughs> See. That's what we should do at Monster Mania. We should try to get some of these celebrities to say, hey, you're listening to the Dace Man Show here on Mega Powers Radio. Yes, I'm up for that, but do you think they will? I think if you paid for that as an autograph instead of... I would pay for a certain of them. Like, if, hey, this is Malcolm McDowell, and you're listening to the Dace Man Show on MegapowersRadio.com. Jesus Christ! Ah, I don't know. Jesus Christ! Ah, ah. Whatever he yelled at the end of Halloween when he broke through the fucking window... <laughs> So there's, we can try to do stuff like that. So check out everything that's going on. We are going to do more stuff. I am tired of sitting around. Uh, let's get famous. If fucking idiots out there can do it, we're bigger idiots and we can do it better. So for the few. For the proud. For the proud. Spectacular. Thank you for tuning in. Peace out, bitches. It's good to I be home. I hate you all. <laughs>